More and more parents are speaking out against attempts by the government and outside groups to impose LGBT issues on primary school children. Seven schools in Greater Manchester have been contacted by parents to complain about proposed lessons. And in Birmingham, several schools have dropped the controversial No Outsiders scheme. Parents are also protesting against lessons at Anderton Park Primary School in Birmingham, which has previously worked with radical LGBT group Educate and Celebrate. The Christian Institute's education officer, John Denning, said schools need to respect parents' views. Well, schools must be kind and welcoming places for all peoples. But some of this teaching goes beyond that. Ellie Barnes, who leads Educate and Celebrate, which works with one of these schools, has said that we must keep driving the rainbow bus until we arrive at the land of social justice. She's entitled to her view, but schools are not entitled to promote a view to children. They also encourage schools to use the video Jamie, a transgender Cinderella tale, which suggests to young girls with an interest in engineering that they may really be boys. Many parents will disagree that the destination of the rainbow bus is really the utopia Ellie Barnes thinks it is. Parents need to have confidence that schools are observing the proper boundaries of their role.